Jordan. Jerry, we have some pretty good plays this week to break down. We've got stuff coming from Northwood, Huntington, and Calvary. You ready to get into it? Let's go. All right, this first one is from Huntington's Dre Robertson fielding the ball here on this kick return, and he's taking it. He's not just fielding the ball. He's taking it 95 yards all the way back. Long runs like this are always impressive. They are, and you got a couple of guys out in front blocking, uh, blocking for him, and he's able to score. And any time you can score on special teams, it's a huge boost. and gives you a much better chance to win. Unfortunately, it didn't happen for them. Uh, Menden had some guys to score a bunch of touchdowns tonight, but just a great job here with special teams and being able to follow the blocks into the end zone uh, for the kickoff return for a touchdown. Showing off those wheels, definitely. All right, this next play is coming from Northwood. Luke Bogan here rolling out. He's going to connect with Patrick Marshall. But watch this right here. Makes Whoop. some stops in his tracks and then spins the other way. Just a dirty, dirty move there. Yeah, I was an offensive lineman, so I never could uh, do anything like this with my feet. But uh, had I been able to do it, I, you know, I may have played a little bit in the NFL. But great job by him to uh, move around and be able to pivot and uh, avoid that, that tackle. Definitely a fun one. And lastly, this is between Calvary and Haynesville tonight. Kobe Bird, he's going to pick up this fumble and take it all the way the other way for the score. All Cavs in this game tonight, but definitely a great play here. Yeah, huge win for uh, Calvary in a hostile environment in Haynesville. And to be able to score on the defensive side of the ball is huge. Uh, I know Coach Gewin is uh, going to like that anytime. Uh, the defense can score, and it, it really is created by guys going in there trying to, uh, you know, strip the ball. And you know, the defensive coaches have drills for that every week and every day. And, and to be able to do that against, again, against a great Haynesville team, uh, really helps Calvary out, especially headed to the playoffs where they're, you know, going to uh, contend for a state championship.